it's Pamela. Today's video is another Invisalign update. I said I was going to give you guys more because I had regretted not doing that before. So I had been to my orthodontist and I got the replacement box of my bottom aligners. So when I change them weekly, I take one from this box and then I take one from this box. If you've noticed, Yes, the elastic is back. My orthodontist told me to continue to wear it to help keep my jaw pushed forward. It's crazy that these little elastics, I'll show you what they look like. It's just this tiny, tiny little thing. And it's enough to help pull your jaw forward. It's great. I think it was like a month or so that I didn't wear these. When I started wearing them again, the tension came back and it was really sore for a few days, but now I'm so used to it that it doesn't bother me anymore. So basically they gave me a box of the bottom aligners and they didn't forget the Pontix. Very happy about that, that those are included and I didn't have to be like, um, you forgot them again. So I have the Pontix in these. So these are my bottom aligners that are gonna help close the gap where I have the space where my teeth were pulled where I'm eventually gonna get the implants. These are the aligners that I originally got. So I just take the top one from this box and the bottom one from this box, obviously. And I've actually managed to get them to catch up. So I'm switching to aligner number five. Am I caught up? Am I caught up or am I just saying this? Oh no, I'm not yet caught up, so when I switch this tomorrow, I'm going to switch to the fourth one for the bottom and the fifth one for the top, basically with the top one for two weeks, and then I'll be all caught up so I don't have to do this weird two weeks on that, one week on that. It's hard enough to remember that this is the day that I changed my aligner, which is fine. If you go over a day, it's fine. And my next appointment isn't until mid-November, so my next Invisalign update won't be until until late November, possibly December. Also, one last thing. I thought that this was my last round of aligners. My orthodontist said something about putting an attachment on one of my teeth. So I think when these are done, I'm getting another round. This this is been endless. I thought that my treatment was being accelerated, like I thought that I was almost done, surprise, surprise, but I think that it actually is going to take the full 22 months. Take my advice, when you see the shifting, you may have hoped that your treatment's going to be shorter, but just assume that it is going to be the full term that your orthodontist said, because your orthodontist is the expert. Anyway, that's the update. That's all I have to say. And I'll let you guys know if anything changes until then. But I'm kind of used to this process now. So I don't think there'll be any major changes. So the next update will be end of November or early December. We'll see. That's everything for this video. If you liked it, please give me a big thumbs up. And if you made it to the end, make sure to hit the subscribe button. I really appreciate having you guys here. Let me know if you're going through the Invisalign process also in the comments section. And that's all I had to say. Thanks for watching.